we're testing the limits of yesterday's update. How fast can you run? How far can you jump? And the overshield is overpowered. This one's really fun, so let's go. Before we start testing all the stuff from yesterday's update, Epic neglected to tell us that they buffed the prop mover. Now, one annoying thing they did update is that when you pick this up, you can't place it down unless it's attached to a prop. I don't know why they made that change. So you can see what I did here is I placed down the prop, then I deleted it so you can see the prop mover. Who cares about that? Let me show you the buff they did. Under path completion action, they now added repeat. So let me show you what we can do with this. We can now have conveyor belts that go continuously and never ever end. So I mean, this is cool, guys. This is never ending here. You can see between my two walls, but let me show you how this is actually working. This is just one long piece that goes down and then it repeats. You see it's going back and then comes over here and then goes back. But from your perspective here, it just looks like a continuous conveyor belt. Now here's one problem. If you ride this, what's gonna happen is it's gonna teleport you back with the props as it resets. You can see there, it just kind of teleports me back. So there is some issues with this, but this makes looping like traffic really easy. All you have to do is place down your cars, set your distances on your prop mover, make sure the prop mover is on repeat, and then you can have continuous loops of traffic. This is a super cool buff. One other thing I missed yesterday is that the new perimeter galleries here respond to your emotes. I mean, check this out here. I mean, everything is like bouncing and grooving. They all have like a unique way to respond. And the lobby here even dances with you. Pretty sweet. Okay, now let's get to testing. I really want to test out the max of the sprinting abilities. I'm going to go into my settings here. We're going to make sure our energy per second is zero and I've maxed everything else out. So when I get up to full speed, we get to go really fast. Man, this is so quick. We also know that when I hit the movement modulator, I definitely pick up speed as well. I'm setting up here a mutator zone that has a movement multiplier of two. We're going to see if that makes a difference as well. But I want to set up a race here to officially time how fast I can get from point A to B. Okay, let's do our first test here. I want to get up to full running speed. This is without any movement multiplier and we're going to see how fast I can actually make this distance. Okay, here we go and it's 5.51 seconds. That's pretty fast to run that distance. Okay, let's do it again, but this time let's get the movement modulator on us. I need to make sure I can get up to full sprint speed before I start this time. And then here we go, start it. Woo, we are flying! Okay, four seconds, 0.75. Wow, I said that really poorly. 4.75 seconds, so that was almost a full second faster. Okay, so now let's try it with the movement modulator on, and then I'm gonna run into the mutator zone. Here we go, boom, we're gonna see if we can make it even faster. Oh my gosh, guys, we are flying! 4.62! Wow, guys, I don't know if that was any faster at all. I mean, it was technically faster, but that could have just been, I don't know, some error in my ability to stay straight. Here, I just wanna stack a few of these on top of each other to see if that makes any difference. All right, here we go. I don't have any boost on me. Here we're going in, and yeah, I don't think this is actually like changing my speed at all. 5.46, yep. Stacking doesn't matter at all in the case of sprinting. So in the case of sprinting, having a movement modulator on is how you can get the fastest speed possible. Okay, so we know how fast we can run. But how far can we jump? So to test this, we're gonna get the battle bus. Let's see, can I jump over this? Yes, we can jump over one battle bus. <laughs> so this is like old evil Knievel stuff here. We're gonna see how many buses we can clear. All right, let's try four buses. So we're getting up to full sprint here and jump. Come on, oh no. All right, all right, I misjumped that one. Okay, let's try this again. Here we go, three, two, one, jump. Oh, we cleared four buses. I don't think we could have cleared it at the front. We definitely could clear it at the back. Let's try six. Getting up to full speed. Oh, yes. I think maybe we can clear one more. Let's give it a try. Seven buses. Here we go. Yes. Woo. Okay, seven is the max at this speed. I, there's no way we can clear eight. I mean, let's try it. But we barely cleared that. Okay, eight full buses. Yeah. No, we can't make eight. Okay, seven is the max. And you have full movement modulator speed on. But if we come into our settings and change gravity to very low, Let's see, we can jump really high. <laughs> oh my gosh. How many of these buses can we jump at this speed? Okay, so right now there's seven. And if I jump now, boom. <laughs> Okay, guys, I would say we cleared that. Let's uh, actually measure by buses, though. Okay, we've got 100 buses here. Can we clear it? Okay, here we go. Testing, jumping 100 buses. Boom. Woohoo! Holy cow, guys, you just launched. Oh, we're definitely clearing 100 buses. Oh my goodness, guys. What? We cleared way past it. Okay, we gotta keep going. All right, now we've got 150 of these buses. We're gonna see if we can clear it. Okay, getting up to full speed and jump. Okay, we hit that perfect. If any jump's gonna clear it, this is the one. Whoa, guys, I think we're gonna do it. I think we're totally got this. Woo! 
Oh, just barely. Okay, wait, I'm just gonna mark this right here's where we landed. Perfect. Two, 153 buses we could have cleared. So that's the official best jump I've got. If you can get a better jump, I wanna see it. Tweet me a video of you jumping more than 153 buses. Okay, now let's push the limits of the overshield. I'm gonna change my recharge delay to instant and the recharge rate to 5,000. Okay, my shield's only though at 50. So I'm curious if I can stay alive against, I don't know, some guard. Okay, here we go. They're all spawning in. We got a whole bunch of these guys here. Oh, guys, they can't hardly even touch me. Look at my overshield recharging so fast. Holy cow, guys. I mean, I, they're doing some damage to my guy, but because it's recharging so quickly, he survived quite a while. And that was against 20 guards. Okay, we're gonna amp this up. I'm gonna change their accuracy to very high so they don't miss me. I can't remember the max number of these guys you can have. I think it's like 40. I'm gonna place down enough of these spawners just to make sure we're maxing out the number of guards. Okay, but now I'm gonna change my overshield to 10,000 health. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be impossible for them to kill me. All right, none of them have noticed me yet. Not a single one. Okay, wait, there he is. Okay, I finally got noticed. All right, come on, guys. Come on. All right, what the heck? Okay, they're supposed to be very accurate. None of them are hitting me. Okay, there we go. Yeah, guys, this is impossible. I'm basically invulnerable here because of my overshield. Holy cow, guys. Okay, you know what we're gonna do? I'm gonna throw everything I can at Peely. I'm gonna give my guards Brutus miniguns. I'm gonna add a whole bunch of sentries with drum guns. I'm gonna add raptors, and I'm gonna add a whole bunch of zombies. Can all of this destroy Mr. Peely here? Okay, here we go, guys. I'm actually worried this is gonna crash the game. Okay, everything's spawning in. Okay, everything's attacking me now. Ah! wild, guys! Oh my gosh, my screen's going crazy! But my health, guys, look at my health! It is barely getting below 9,000! The overshield has made me virtually indestructible. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Uh, the friendly fire is not working. All of the zombies and stuff are dying. Like, I don't even see any raptors. You know what? I'm just gonna let Peely take a seat here in the middle. Enjoy his time as an invulnerable banana! Hey, I wanna play with clouds for a second. First, let's see if we can put a prop mover on it. Oh, we can! Let's see what it looks like when it moves. Okay, there. Whoa, guys, it's got some weird funky stuff going on. It appears as if this is one of those dynamic surfaces that kind of moves with the prop mover. I want to make like a little cloud tunnel here. Let's see what it looks like when I stand in the middle of it. Okay, I've got prop movers on all of the clouds here. Let's see what this looks like. What the heck? I mean, that's really interesting. Let's see what it looks like outside. It's actually kind of cool. I like the effect that it has on the actual clouds. Oh, you know what? This gives me another idea. Let's bust out our new primitive gallery here. I'm gonna grab this tube. We're gonna blow it all the way up. Make a nice long tube here. Oh man, this is gonna be cool. We're gonna throw prop movers on all of this. And then let's choose some trippy colors. Oh my gosh. Whoa, guys, it looks so crazy in here. Okay, here we go. Let's see what it looks like with the prop mover. Oh my goodness, guys. I'm like in some weird dream. Oh, this is kind of making me nauseous. Oh man, when I do an emote in here, check this out. It's like a dance party. Oh, this is amazing. You gotta try a few more of these. This is galactic. Man, check this out. This is so cool in here. All right, we got to see how this looks moving. This is kind of cool. It feels like we're going through some like wormhole or something. Let's see if this one reacts to us. Oh, it does, guys. It changes colors. Okay, now that is awesome. Whoa, guys. Hex pulse here is wild. Oh, yeah, guys. Synth wave is awesome. This is so cool, guys. What an awesome update. This out. It's like a dance party. Oh, this is amazing. You got to try a few more of these. This is galactic. Man, check this out. This is so cool cool in here. All right, we gotta see how this looks moving. This is kind of cool. It feels like we're going through some, like, wormhole or something. Let's see if this one reacts to us. Oh, it does, guys. It changes colors. Okay, now that is awesome. Whoa, guys. Hex pulse here is wild. Oh, yeah, guys. Synth wave is awesome. This is so cool, guys. What an awesome update. 